Hi guys, it's Gene, and I'm going to try out another Portuguese Duolingo lesson. We're going to go with Past Imperfect. So that's, um, I used to go this way to work. That would be the Past uh, Imperfect. It was the uh, ongoing or in incomplete action in the past. Uh, bevia, I... Uh, used to drink. Um, right here is bebia. I used to drink. Uh, comium. We uh, used to eat. I used to eat that every day for breakfast. That would be an um, ongoing or uncompleted, not a one-time action in the past. So let's see if we can test out of it. Where's the sound? Any sound? Eu estava lendo um livro. Uh, I was reading a book. Eu estava lendo um livro. I was reading a book. This is also an interrupted action in the past. So, I was reading a book when she walked past me naked. <laughs> Something like that. So, uh, this is also... Uh, uh, another use of the the past imperfect. Imper I used to go that way every day. All right, so that's one way, and then it's also I was going in that direction when the meteor came out of the sky in front of me. So there's um, those are the like two most Eu common uses. De domingo a domingo. I was working from Sunday to Sunday. All right. You could, I think you could probably say, I don't know Portuguese, but you could probably say I used to work from Sunday to Sunday. I was working from Sunday to Sunday. Yeah, see, I think that's correct based on my knowledge of the past imperfect in other Romance languages? But again, I don't understand. I don't know Portuguese. So, I'm going to go ahead and tell him I think I was right. Just for fun. Um, that was part of his of the work. That was part of the job. That, uh, that was part of the job. So, era, era, uh, era, I'm really, I'm not real good at pronouncing Portuguese, is just the same as in um, Spanish. It's a past imperfect, past imperfect of the verb to be. Um, Ela não pensava assim. Ela não pensava assim. She didn't think so. Ela não pensava assim. She did not used to think that way. Oh, that is not English, guys. Sorry, but that is... There is a problem with this lesson. There's another mistake. She didn't used to think this way. All right. Okay, so that is how we speak English, at least in America. That's terrible grammar. That is a, a and um, that's a perversion of a way we use the past imperfective, which is she used not to think this way. Okay. And uh, so, that's grammatically incorrect, but you would also say, she didn't think so. Uh, uh, or, she she didn't think that way, or she didn't think that way before. That would be a perfect translation. I mean, not a, not a word-for-word -word translation, but it would be perfectly suitable. I, she didn't think that way before. I wanted new shoes. 
Sapatos. Eu jogava tênis quando era estudante. Oh, I used to play tennis when I was a student. Uh-oh. See, if I just hit check here, then I would have got... I, there we go, I used to play tennis when I was a student. Okay. Okay, so now that's proof that my understanding of the past imperfect in romance, as it's used in romance languages, uh, um transfers into Portuguese, in which case I really should have gotten that other one right. Uh, uh, she won the uh, matches or whatever, competitions, or he, sorry, he used to win the competitions. This could also, all right, this could also be used in a in one of those compound sentences where he was winning the matches one after another when along came the uh, all, uh, when along came his the the opponent that finally brought him to his knees whatever so this is this is translated as he used to win the competitions but I I want those of you who are watching this to know that this can be used in a lot of different contexts that will dictate a different translation into English. So I'm not even going to look at these two because Desde and Entre. I don't even need to read the whole sentence. Eu os amava menos que ela. Uh. <laughs> That's weird. Uh, I loved them less than her. Strange sentence. Um, Ele seguia as normas. Okay. He used to follow the norms. He used not to rock the boat. Eu esperava aquele resultado. Eu esperava aquele resultado. Eu esperava aquele resultado. Aquele. Eu esperava aquele resultado. I used to wait for that result, or I was waiting for the result when suddenly the phone rang. Were. Estavam. Estavam. Okay. Let's try this one. The telephone would not stop ringing. Oops, sorry. Sorry, guys. O telefone. Well, I think tocar is ring in Portuguese because I'm guessing because in Spanish when you say ring the doorbell you say tocar la puerta and it also means you, when you ring the bell you tocar uh, I don't know the word for bell or, or it's like playing an instrument a percussion instrument or like a chimes you'd be tocar or any instrument is tocar so I think the phone I think it's the first one. Ele sempre fazia algum comentário. Ele sempre fazia um comentário. What the heck? Sempre. I got to I got to pronounce it like a gringo. <laughs> To get it to go. Come on! Fazio. Um. Oh, come on. Ele sempre. 
sempre fazia algum comentário. Algum. Ele sempre fazia algum. Ele sempre fazia algum comentário. Bang! Whoa! He would always make a comment. Okay, so that, he was the guy who always raised his hand in class. He always had something to say. I don't know anybody like that. Uh, oh. Uh, oh, dihito. Diretor. 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 Oh, diretor. Diretor. Uh. Let's see what it says. Okay, we got it. All right, cool. Pintor mudava as cores da parede. Um, I don't know mudava, and I don't know cores. I don't know what mudava means, and I don't know what cores. Cor. The painter, the painter. What the heck is a painter? Can't even speak. The, p, the. P, oops, sorry, 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 sorry. The. I was holding it so still too. The painter. was removing the pictures from the wall. <sighs> wall. I don't know this one. Okay, he was changing the colors of the wall. Oh, cor, cor is color. Color, cor. Oh, cor. Dang, dang it. The painter was changing the colors of the wall. Havia dois carros na rua. Oh, there were two cars on the street. There were two cars on the street. Okay, non-native speakers of English. That can also be there were two cars in the street. In the street. So. Ele mantinha a torre fechada. He kept the uh, tower closed. <laughs> okay, right? Let's see what we did here. I lost, I did not get all the hearts, but I did not make the owl cry. Am I on track for today? I am on track for today. Good job. Let's see what's my streak. I'm at 76 days. And how many Portuguese points do I have? 3,860 points. All right. I'm learning Portuguese. Thanks for tuning in.